back to my class and you're here at Missy TV. For today's video, we're going to discuss about dividing rational expression. Alright, so for example, in number 1, we have 7 over 6x divided by 7 over 12. So first step is to multiply the reciprocal of the divisor. So it will become 7 over 6x times, so it will become multiplication because we're going to multiply the reciprocal of our divisor. So the reciprocal of 7 over 12 is 12 over 7. Okay? So now, let's simplify. Since 7 is divided by 7 is 1, so that is cancelled. So we can also simplify 12 and then 6 because 6 divided by 6 is 1 and then 12 divided by 6 is 2. Now let's multiply. 1 times 2 is 2 over 1 times 1 is 1. Since we do not write 1 in our denominator, so our final answer in number 1 is 2. How about if we have this case in number 2? So we have x raised to 5th power over 4 divided by 4x squared. Okay? So here, our denominator is 1. Okay? So we have here imaginary 1. For example, 2. So 2 is equal to 2 over 1. Right? 5. The whole number 5. So we have here 5 over 1. Okay? For example, we have a b. This is um, equivalent to a b over 1. Alright? So in our case here is 4x squared. We have um, imaginary 1 here. Okay? So next is multiply the reciprocal of our divisor. So again, we have x to the 5th power over 4, alright, times the reciprocal of our divisor of uh, 4x squared over 1 is 1 over 4x squared, right? Next is let's um, multiply. So it will become x to the 5th power over 16x squared. Alright? But, we can simplify this x to the 5th power over 16x squared. Okay? So, we have here uh, the factors of x to the 5th power since the lowest exponent here between x raised to the 5th power and then x squared is 2. So, we have the factors x squared times x cubed because x squared times x cubed is x to the 5th power. Then over 16 times x squared. So now we can divide or we can simplify. x squared divided by x squared is 1, so that is cancelled. Now our final answer here is x cubed over 16. There. For number 3, we have 2 over 21x plus 3 divided by 2 over 28x plus 4. So again, we're, we're going to factor first our denominator. So we're going to factor first. So 2 over, since we have the common factor here, 3, so factored out 3. Okay? So 21x divided by 3 is 7x plus 3 divided by 3 is 1. Next is to multiply the reciprocal of our uh, of our divisor so times so our divisor is 28x plus 4 so 28x plus 4 over 2 okay next we can factor 28x plus 4 so it will become 2 over 3 7x plus 1 times so, our common factor here is 4. So, factor out 4. 4, 28 divided by 4 is 7x plus 4 divided by 4 is 1 over 2. Okay? So, now, um, let's simplify. Since um, 7x plus 1 divided by 7x plus 1 is 1, so that is cancel. And then, we can also cancel this one. So, 2 divided by 2 
is 1. So, that is also cancel. So, our final answer is 1 times 4 is 4. And then, 3 times 1 is 3. So, our answer in number 3 is 4 over 3. For number 4, we have x minus 5 over x squared minus 2x minus 15 divided by 1 over x minus 5. So, first, again, so let's factor the denominator of this. So, we have x minus 5 over, so the factors of x squared is x times x. Next, again, think of a number. If we multiply, the answer is negative 15. And then, if we add them, the answer is negative 2. So, we have 5 and 3. Okay? So, negative 5 plus 3. Because negative 5 times positive 3 is negative 15. And then, negative 5 plus 3 is negative 2. Okay? Next is to multiply the reciprocal of our divisor. So, it will become x minus 5 over 1. Now, simplify. So, we can divide this one. So, x minus 5 divided by x minus 5 is 1. So, now, simplify. So, x minus 5 times 1 is x minus 5 over x plus 3 times 1 is x plus 3. So, our final answer in number 4 is x minus 5 over x plus 3. For the last example, so this is complicated to see, but this is very easy. Okay, so we have 9a plus 24 over 5a squared plus 10 divided by 12a plus 32 over 4a plus 8. So again, we will factor first this and also this one. Okay, for 9a plus 24, we have the common factor 3. So, 3, okay? So, factored out 3. 9a divided by 3 is 3a. Next, plus 24 divided by 3 is 8. Okay? So, our denominator, so we can factor out 5 since they have the common factor 5. So, we have 5. Alright? So, 5a squared divided by 5 is a squared. Next, 10 divided by 5 is 2. Okay, next, uh, multiply the reciprocal of our divisor, so times. So, 4a plus 8 over 12a plus 32. Next is, let's factor our divisor, so it will become 3 times 3a plus 8 over 5 times a squared plus 2 times so the common factor of 4a and 8 is 4 so let's divide 4a divided by 4 is a plus 8 divided by 4 is 2 over so uh, we have also common factor here so 12 a and 32 so we have 4 12a divided by 4 is 3a plus 32 divided by 4 is 8. Okay? Now, simplify. So, 3a plus 8 divided by 3a plus 8 is cancel. Alright? Next, 4 divided by 4 is also cancel because that is 1. Next, let's um multiply. So, we have 3 times a plus 2 and then 5 a squared plus 2 okay let's use the distributive property so 3 a uh, 3 times a is 3 a 3 times 2 is 6 so plus 6 here then next 5 times a squared is 5 a squared and then 5 times 2 is 10 plus 10 so our final answer and that's how we end our lesson for today if you have more questions so please comment down below and don't forget to subscribe on my channel bye bye